In his last outing, eight points for him. Green in the post. Pounded by Westbrook. And it's Green missing. Wall against MP. Lays it up and banks it in. And now it's an 11-point Los Angeles lead. He's pulling out all the tricks this quarter. They can't figure out how to stop him. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long. Outside wall. And there's the drive. Two points. That one goes. Wall's got 24 points. Oh, he's been dominant this quarter. I mean, he's determined to prevent the lead from getting any bigger. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be... The boys play. He's not down every free throw. I mean, I love to see this kind of efficiency. Free throw good. MP. No, just much more assertive offensively in the second quarter. He's putting pressure on this defense and earning trips to the line. And the Rockets shooting a red-hot 63% in this game. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. Los Angeles ball. In the game, I mean, that pass should have been basic. Westbrook finds Howard to the paint. Here's MP. Oh, and the dunk by MP. Oh, improving his floor awareness. Howard has a decent sense for when his guys are open. Green against Westbrook. Ooh, Howard with a block. A nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. A fantastic effort on D to get up in his face and deny the layup. Thanks, well, MP in their last game against the Spurs was all business. He contributed 40 points, and it felt like he couldn't miss, whether from the field, from the line. He was awesome. He was dominant, and they're hoping to get more of the same from him tonight. Take it away. Yeah, he was unstoppable during certain stretches. It'd be great to see him top that performance tonight. Well, his team needs him to contribute. When he's on his A game, he just makes play after play. It's all about getting into a comfort zone early. When he does that, he can be very difficult to contain the rest of the way. MP, a screen on green. Inside, here's MP. And MP throws it down. Sharp passes there from Westbrook. You like seeing him be active and trying to set up his teammates. And if you want to nasty, look no further than Russell Westbrook. He fights for every shot he gets. He doesn't let anyone on the other team get his way. Here's Shangun. Hey, how's that for an answer? Right back with the dunk. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. They needed that, and I love that he just did something for What a finish. I mean, he just took over himself. What a show of power right there from the point guard. Man, sweet. Oh, but his teammates love that kind of energy, fellas. I mean, don't take like this demonstrate leadership. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. And, Chris, when you think about the ferocity Westbrook plays with, his rebounding really comes to mind. No, that's a three. At his size, Westbrook shows the force on the glass. Anthony but Davis. His intensity levels and playing for him allow him to get out. Bigger guys. Timeout charge to Houston. Timeout called. Houston.
That's the end of the first half. With a score, your Rockets 72, the Lakers 87. to mount a comeback one side trying to protect their lead here's wall and he's got 28 now batting the backcourt it's wall and green tate and tice holding down the forward spots and it's shangun in at the center position that's the five for houston right now green's gone just two of seven from the floor here westbrook the pass to mp back to westbrook here's mp Here's Howard, and it's Howard what? finishing it off. And you need an army to keep Howard away from the basket. He's so superb at snatching up offensive rebounds. Here's Wall. Excellent D there from Westbrook. Man, when the ball's in his hands, that's as high percentage as it gets. It's just a fluke miss. Pass to Howard. Down low. Back to MP. Kicks it out to Westbrook. Double team on James. And it's Howard finishing it off. Howard can still wreck the rim when he gets in deep. Boy, the Rockets really having a tough go here. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Wall. That shot is off. And Los Angeles the other way now. Next matchup, they'll be at home against the Wizards. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. Well, part of the game plan was to neutralize the crowd. And guess what? Mission accomplished. Their poise has been tremendous. The excellent at both ends has them increasing this lead. And that was good. Green. Oh, you'd like to see a stronger pick than that, but it turns out he didn't need the help. Westbrook, the pass to Howard. <laughs> Another one Houston. falls. Good. Amazing. Good. How is that Green. a foul? That's his first. That's Making it look easy. Free throw good, MP. The Rockets have gotten only one of four shots to fall in the second half. And it's Green missing. Now Los Angeles with it. They've gone on a 10-2 run, not allowing much. And it's Howard finishing it off. Now this is the chemistry Howard has with this guy. It's fantastic at realizing when to go for alley -oop. Outside, Green. Pass to Wall. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got four rebounds now. MP outside. Davis against Wall. 
Davis, the pass to MP. That one falls. Coming off Davis' feed. Davis has got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Tice sets a screen. Wall, the pass to Tice. And the foul on Anthony Davis. That's foul number two for him. That's his second personal foul. First team foul. Westbrook against Wall. On the defensive end, much more energy and effort since halftime. They're making their opponents work for every look. Great job. Daniel Tice. That's his first personal foul. At the line for the Lakers. Number 23. One shot. One shot. Throw good, MP. Timeout call. Houston. To Houston. Things just aren't. Man. Your clutch city. I'm sure coach is going to let them know that. Boy, they're in a rough patch right now. <laughs> yeah, momentum is definitely not on their side. Wall finds Green. And it's hammered home oh, by Green. Man. Terrific work from Wall. Assessing the situation and finding the uncovered teammate. Here's MP, and they're going to count that bucket, and they'll send him to the foul. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. These last seasons, we've had the privilege of listening to our players when they use their voices, and it's also been amazing to see the NBA work to support them. You know, our players are empowered to stand up for, for what they believe in. I mean, it started with players like Bill Russell, Spencer Haywood, uh, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and that's what our league is about. And, and we know that's a very special thing. Out of bounds. bounds. Los Angeles will have Los it. Angeles An ball. easy pass to a terrible turnover. Your and that's a possession waste. Even no and the Rockets making a change here. Nuava's checked in. To the inside. Here's MP. And yes! Another basket! That's 62 points. 62. Amazing. A remarkable performance from him so far. Ball against Westbrook. Outside, Green. Shot clock at five. Ooh, Howard with a block. You gotta be aware of Howard at all times, especially on defense, where he makes his living blocking shots. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. James passes to MP. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. All right, guys, what do you think about the hustle stats for the Lakers? All those block shots, that's a clear indicator of the great D they've been playing. Not giving them an inch of space out there. I'll tell you something else. The points they've scored on the fast break tonight have been a major factor. MP, the pass to James. Back to MP. Here's Davis. And he battles for the ball, gets the second chance bucket. Davis has got nine points. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Right wing. Back to wall. And the foul called on John Wall. That's his fourth. John Wall. How is that a foul? That's his fourth personal foul. Is that a foul? Now he's going to have to be careful. Still a little ways to go and only two fouls to spare. And for the Lakers, they're shooting 71%. Their offense has looked unstoppable all game long. To the middle. And he throws it down with one hand. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. Yeah, going defense to offense in an instant. Every team now calibrated to do that. Time now to hear from our reporter, Ali LaForce. Hey, Brian. When speaking about LeBron James, Commissioner Adam... Jalen Green. That's his second workers, personal foul. Which has as much to do with the success of his career as anything else. Also, off the court, it's incredible what he's done. He is a marvel in so many ways, but it all comes back to his focus and his dedication. Thanks, Ali. Anthony's checked in for Howard. Man, miss after miss for him. When you're having a quarter like this, his only beneficiary is the defense. Porter Jr., he's checked in for Wall. 
Kevin Porter Jr. And so it's Houston with it. Pass to Shangun. Outside Tate. Nuaba, screen on Anthony. Up top Tate. Looking at the numbers, he's putting up seven points a game. The Rockets with another miss. The defense has done a good job of forcing him into tough shots this quarter. And Anthony Davis' first seven seasons he spent in New Orleans, I mean, he never made it past the second round. But playing with LeBron, <laughs> that makes all the difference. Anthony. The assist numbers certainly stand out. <laughs> They've really emphasized ball movement here today. Green finds Porter. They set the pick. And a foul call. Anthony Davis. That's his third personal foul. Lakers substitution. Timeout charge to Houston. Now in the lineup for your Rockets. Usman Baruba. Outside Porter. Pass to Gordon. Back to Porter. Gordon outside. To the wing on the left. Six to shoot. Tries a 10-footer. And he hits the jumper. The Lakers have gotten six of eight shots to fall during this fourth. And so in the game for the Lakers, Davis slides in at four with Howard playing center. MP is out there with Malik Monk. And it's Ariza in at the three. Number 23. That's his third personal foul. Third team foul. They're finding a rhythm from the line as they try to cut into this deficit. Porter hits them both. Yeah, they're playing catch up at this point, but they've done a nice job at the free throw line here in the second half. Here's Ariza. Howard, the pass to MP. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. And just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. Oh, yeah, that's what you love about him. He shows no mercy, even with the comfortable lead. Gordon. Rebound, Anthony Davis. Davis has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. That's a good break. I mean, it's tough to connect on those long distance passes. Augustine, he's checked in for the Rockets. Augustine. It's Monk on the wing. On the wing, MP. Back to Monk. MP finds Monk. Howard with a screen on Porter. The drive by MP. So it'll be two free throws. DJ Augustine. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. And we're seeing a bunch of top high school prospects go pro now, Chris. Do you think that'll hurt the college game? Well, if it's just a five-star athlete, because they're one and done probably anyway. Uh, but I, if I'm uh, college, I, I would hope that the pro leagues uh, don't expand any more. Because if it did, it could cause a major shift. The Lakers have gotten seven of nine from the floor in this fourth. Outside Davis. Howard, the pass to MP. Tipped! And here's Gordon. Four on the clock. Ooh, Howard with a block. Los Angeles has gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. MP, the pass to Howard. Back to MP. And it's good! He hits another one! And he is simply unconscious. Nobody can stop him right now. Boy, the points keep coming, and he's climbing that scoring ladder. Third on the list, well in sight. Out to the wing. Here's Martin. There's a screen. And Davis with the block. And they'll keep possession. The Lakers have gone 8 of 11 from the field in the fourth. Pass to Ariza. Back to MP. 
Yet another oh bucket. <laughs> this game has his name written Trevor all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. Gordon, the pass to Porter. They double him with MP. To stop the drought. And he was fouled. Trevor Ariza. That's his third personal foul. At the line for your Rockets. Gordon, no good on the free throw. Well, I think it's Gordon's diverse skill set that makes him a great supporting player. He can fill any gaps in your game, offense or defense. And Houston ball. Good hands, guys. Good hands. Substitution for your Rockets. Now five seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. And it's hammered home by Green. And he's playing the game with a certain flair right now. Oh, he caps off the move with a little hang time on the rim. And the basket by MP. And guys, that's got to be the dagger. This is how you finish a game. Yeah, I love how they play for one another out there. No signs of selfishness. Okay, just a total team effort. Yeah. Gliding the pass to where it needed to be. Wow, a strong finish to seal the deal. So we see the Lakers taking the W here the end to walk the into enemy territory. Let's go, let's go. Thank you for coming out and supporting your team. Please take care to get home safely, and we'll see you at the next event. All right, Frank, you want to start us off? Look, the playoffs are coming up, and it looks like you could be hosting at least one series, right? That's the plan. Well, this deep into the season, is the team as focused on the playoff push as they should be? Or do you see guys starting to lose that focus? Um, I don't, I don't think anybody's losing focus. And if anyone starts to slip, we got a locker room full of people and guys that are pulling back together. You know, we got one goal, and we're all in this together, working to make it happen, Frank. All right, well, since playing at home should increase your odds of advancing, have you started thinking about how you're going to spend that extra playoff income? <laughs> Not at all. Look, first off, we haven't earned anything yet, and there's a lot of work that needs to be done to get there. But more importantly, Frank, my focus is on trying to help this team win. I'm not about to start worrying about what I might do afterwards. Yeah, but don't you have your eyes on any bling? Hey, look, just a ring, Frank. Torres, what's going on? Looking at your schedule coming up, it looks like there will be some off days, chance to, you know, give your body a rest. But it got me thinking, what's your perfect off day, MP? Ooh, off days are hard, man. I just feel guilty robbing the people of their daily dose of MP. <laughs> uh, so most of the time, I'm just trying to go somewhere where I can show off my look, you know, my ride, my swag. I probably go somewhere like the show I'm putting on the beatbox. Little metal's gonna be there. It's an MP production, so it's about to be lit. Very slick bit of promotion there, MP. Hey, look, I'm just trying to spread the word on the show that's about to pop. You've been focused a lot on music lately. So are you worried that might open you up to criticism that you're not devoted to basketball? I'm not about to start worrying about what other people think. Bloggers, teammates, coaches, they all just jealous because there's nothing I can't do, bro. Look, come to Little Metal Show and you'll see how I created another superstar. All right. Well, thanks, MP. I hope the show goes well for you and Little Metal. Hey, yo, thank you, Andrew. Okay. All right, y'all. How we doing today? Uh, first question, Frank. Now, MP, looks like you're, you're happy in this new environment. You know, after watching you play with the new squad, I wonder if you feel like the old team was holding you back. You know, I wouldn't necessarily say that. It's just possible that this team is a better fit for me and my skill set. And after the way I played in the first game, believe it or not, Frank, I'm, I'm actually really excited to get back on the practice court. And if I can just continue to work with the rest of the guys and, and build some familiarity, look out. Well, you know, after the way you forced your way out of your previous stop, 
can this team count on you to stick around or should they be worried about a pattern or uh, some kind of behavior? Let me set the record straight, Frank. This team can absolutely count on me, okay? I'm happy to be here. I'm, I'm happy to be playing with these guys, and I'm happy to do whatever I need to do to fit in with this new locker. Well, at least for now, right? Hey, yo, Frank, you got any more questions, man? Uh, no, no, thanks. I'm good. Okay, we good? Thank you. <laughs>